How's everybody doing today? In today's video, we are starting fresh on a No White 10X. It's going to be an amazing time. It's going to be a slow startup, but we get into some amazing things. With that being said, today's video was brought to you, recorded, and sponsored by Vanquished Arc. Vanquished Arc is a No Wipe ASE Xbox and Windows 10 server that launched on the 24th. They have six man tribe limit, 10 times harvest, weekly events, active admins, and of course, it is a No Wipe. There is still plenty of opportunity to build up. It has been an amazing time. There's always hidden spots. Get your turrets up and then move into a cave and just have an amazing amazing time pvping and all of the above with that being said they have some amazing quality of life changes the server has been amazingly balanced and i've had a great time over here on vanquish dark join their discord that is linked in the description and the pinned comment with that being said enjoy today's video oh shit i'm not you know very advanced you know i am like but uh oil cave they have only like all right, well, I can't get the best look. I don't know if you've seen the video. They only have three heavies, three, four heavies in there. If I can get leveled up and get built up, I might actually raid oil cave. Hell, I might even take it over. So my recording didn't record the first probably, I'd say, like 20 minutes. But pretty much what we did is we have a spot over in the cliffside, kind of near oil cave with some forges down, getting a smithy up, fabricator, and all of that. But pretty much that's all you guys missed. Just us slowly farming some things up. We're going to get some resources, get a bunch of metal, and hopefully be able to raid oil cave. But I'm not sure, though, because I think they're advancing a lot quicker than I am because they have more members. I am probably going to get the wife in the tribe later on, but it's going to be an amazing time. If we can raid them, we can raid them. You know, it is what it is. If we don't, uh, I'm going to get try to get some trikes. And yeah, I think that's going to be the best bait. Uh, best, uh, what am I trying to say? Jesus. The best chance of raiding them, I should say. Man, my English is so bad. I need to go to bed. But here, we're here grinding arc. That's what I love to do. I enjoy making videos. So hopefully you guys do enjoy them. Like the video, subscribe. But yeah, I'm going to speed through this. I'm going to cut through some of the farming. And we're going to get the building the base up. All right, I'm making a mailing saddle up real quick, and then I am going to uh, get a mailing just to make my life a little easier. Get some trace going, rhinos, whatever I need, and then we can raid. I did thankfully get, uh, yeah, so we have an RA trike saddle. I'm going to keep looking around the drops and stuff. We can't get anything better. At least we do have that, and we might be able to soak this few heavies. If not, if I get some flak BPs or anything like that, I can probably C spin it, dive it. But I think I'm going to try to trike soak it right now. Because as you can tell, I'm not even that high of a level, but it'd be hilarious if I could actually raid an oil cave as quick as I can. I might go over to extinction though, try to get some levels going real quick. My PT is taking forever to level. We got some metal going. Uh, we got the spark powder made. I need to remember to get some charcoal trees while I'm over there farming. Uh, we got some narcotics being made. I have some tranks, so I'm going to get some rhinos and probably trikes, get some maywings, things like that. Now that we have a Maywing, it's going to be a lot easier to get around the map, including actually finding some cementing paste, some beaver dams, I should say, that is not actually taken already. 
Mei Wing's are just such an OP early game team to have. You can just get around the map so much faster. We're also going to kill some Parasaurs to get some electronics, oil, and you also get a little bit of metal, which always helps too. Uh, it's very nice to get a early game electronics, especially if you don't want to head over to Extinction. We're still going to do that a little bit and try to hit level 100. We're almost at the point where we can put down a first auto. I do want to farm up a bunch more oil for just gas and other things as well, just to help us advance in the long run. Wait a minute. Seven hours. Oh, that's a no eye, but I am not used to that. I feel like that is way too long for a a trait timer to breed. Holy shit. Well, I'm not going to be breeding up. None of the wife's going to join me and she's going to craft some shit while I sit on these to level them up a little faster. I just got this. I got a bag to you. It's easy to just find a bed. I didn't even get to take my boots off. Well, we're aiming for your boots. Let's go check up on Oreo Cave. See what they've been up to. What the f? Uh, maybe we are not raiding this? Oh shit, it's gonna be a tower render in? What the fudge? How did it get built so fast? You think they donated? Or am I just tripping? They're online still. that off yeah I, I literally have nothing on me so no point hmm might be out of our breeding zone you know what I mean right now we'll see but that's crazy all right so a little bit ago I came over here I was doing some farming getting some flint getting some drops and things and then I found in this rat hole there is a tribe or at least a solo setting up it looked like they only had maybe one, two turrets. They weren't even heavies yet. I guess I'm not the only one that hasn't reached heavies yet. So um, I'm going to quickly see if I can actually blow it up. Literally all I have is primitive flak and a few C4 bed. If we have to, I can go get the trike and we can actually soak it. But oh, where was it? I actually built in this rat hole in the past on like old 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 arkland a few years ago when like lost first released it's i think it's over that way once my cryo timer is down we'll actually just throw out the maywing but um it's like it's just a little little desert rat hole and originally i thought it was really good but then you know as metas changed things got different i started to realize it's really not that good of a spot but uh we're going to see. I think because it's only like two autos, I might be able to just run in and see four real quick. We'll see. I think I'm here. Oh, shit. Yes. Scenic is like loading. So what is that? One, two? These two? Let's them one in the back. It does just look like two. Uh, two autos, prim flag, shouldn't be a problem, I would think, but you never know, you never know. Give it a go, though. Let me see if I can get a bed out here. Oh, perfect. I'm gonna make this quick, just in case they are on. I did not bring... Oh, but I can't throw this out for storage. We'll put pretty much everything up, I think. Bring 2C4. Uh, 
Let's see if I see anybody moving around. Should I just try to get behind it, or should I just blow the turrets? I'm just trying to blow the turrets. Holy shit. I fucked with the beds. Hold on, I'm almost dead. I do not see them in here, so I don't know if they're off the map, but um. But one extra C4. Over here. Oh. I mean, it's not crazy, but something. Some resources. Oh. We need it. We're going to be moving into our main base in a bit. The plus side about, um, oh, they didn't have much ammo at all. The plus side about a 10x, you know, no wipe server is because it's 10x, you don't get all your infinite, like, instant levels and stuff. Uh, it's definitely a lot more of a slower build up for a lot of people, which is nice because you actually get some early game raids and stuff that, uh, they're locked. I'm not going to break those. They're literally just campfires. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's nice. I mean, you get early game raids like this. Not everybody gets tech within an hour. Um, I do kind of feel bad a little bit. He did have a decent amount though, especially resource wise. Didn't have any games or anything. Uh, I'm gonna feel bad though. He's probably gonna transfer back over and see they don't have beds. Uh, but hey, I'm st I only got like three uh, auto turrets up on my base, so pretty even. It was definitely definitely worth giving it a go. But if you guys are new around here, make sure you guys please go down below, subscribe, like the video, it really does help. I appreciate all the love and support recently. And with that being said, I will catch you guys in the next video. Uh, next video, we're going to move into our main base. We're going to get built up. We're going to get some bigger and better things done. I appreciate it. And with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.